with the old, in with the new. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to another episode of Building a Custom Home. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button down below, and I hope you enjoy it. Today, we're building a roof. Sounds like I'm on HGTV. Let me pick up a tool for five seconds. Shoot two nails, and then I'll have someone that actually knows what they're doing come in and do the rest. Just kidding, that's not how it works here. Go up and stay by that, that corner. Until you get your sea legs. We'll keep you close. Oh, you can stay there if you want. So these need to spin. That freaking first truss right there needs to lay down. So you're trying to set it down right there? Let's go down. I think they're mellow enough. What's that? I think they're mellow. They're small. What's that? No, we're going to leave them just like this. If they were bigger, taller, they would have a tendency to fall more, but these are fine. Guys, this is the moment I wait for on every single build. Take our gable end here, that's gonna sit flush right here, inch and a half back. OSB will run up this gable as well. We're gonna take little scraps and kind of fill it in all the way through. While we're getting these trusses up here, we have a last minute window that needs to go in right there. It goes above our little set of mono trusses. Once that's in, we can shear it, put our mono trusses in from there down, and then the rest of this stacks out. Unfortunately, they're kind of stacked all different ways. So we're actually going to the other side of the building now. So that gable end right there needs to go out. We'll set it up the same way we did that one. What do you mean? What do you mean? They nail on the plate. You'll stack all of them right here. We'll grab the first one. You hold it like this. We both walk at the same time all the way down. Set it in place, pin it. We have hangers that go all the way along there. So you're just going to drop yours in the hanger. Wow, 
wow, these things are coming in all sideways. There we go. Don't walk out. With stuff like this, always let us bring it to you. you can't really stop. You're good. I know. Let them come to you. Don't reach out like that. They'll they'll come to you. So now he'll pull them back and lay them flat on their sides. Yep. Yep. More. Yep. So today is Saturday, guys. As you can see, though, we're not the only ones working. They got a pump out here. They're about to start pouring that foundation. We're gonna get all of our trusses up on the roof today. We have a section over there that we're gonna start with. Not sure how far we're gonna get. We do have to head over to another project for a bit, but we will be back for the rest of the afternoon to hammer down and get as much done as possible. Depending on the size of the roof, the pitch of the roof, everything, scissor trusses, flat bottom cord. So depending on all those variables, we do things different. You can see we laid these on its side and that's because none of those over there have tails. Those all hang around to the building, therefore, they are not long enough to land on that plate. So we laid them on their sides. Those little ones over there, it's a cakewalk. You just throw them up. They sit just like that. Since they're banded together, they don't move. We'll get all the trusses up here, all the trusses on the great room. The only thing we'll keep down is like the minor fill, the small stuff here and there. But for the most part, everything will be up today. Yeah, so you can see how our hip's gonna work out. The truss that he's hooked around at the top has an opening for our hips to go into on both sides. Then the last two trusses are for the hips to run through. So these will come up just like that, stack on there and lay down. You're really not gonna be able to. Just stay right where you're at. And when it gets close enough, you're gonna have to pull down Up, tilt down. Hit me in the face, go for it. Atta boy.
This is what I like to do, guys. I've said it a million times, though. Wall framing is the cakewalk. The roof is where it gets fun. We've got some goofy spots over in here. Full hip up here that goes over everything. Entryway has a little hip out the front. That side over there is just a straight shot. So this right here, where these trusses come off of this building and tie into a doubler that way is going to be really the hardest thing about this roof. Should go smooth. Now, if I remember correctly, there's a coffered ceiling detail as well with some faux beams running through here. That gives it a really nice look. Okay. Where's GL1 out on the bottom? On the bottom. So we want that to sit right here. On the front. On the I am determined to get that kid up on the roof too. He's a good little framer. It's just gonna take time. You're not gonna wanna get up there. Grab a small ladder. There it goes. If you thought walking two by six was bad, two by four is your worst nightmare. I, I noticed that when I was on that. I'll, I'll try to walk on that two by four though. Let's go up. I know, go up. Let's go. Just one. We have to pull it. I'm gonna stick this right here. that goes these are just filler this will go towards the outside of the garage though slam back now this should 
Uh, go, go the other way. Like go under the, yeah. That should be about perfect right there. Okay. We're gonna lay it on the edge of the garage right here though. Yeah, we'll lay it down here and then back down. Awesome. That's a buddy of mine's mom right there. I love seeing that truck around. It's a breast cancer awareness truck. It's my friend's mom that drives it. Just wanna have a driver too. Does that work for you? You wanna you want walk those plates? I want that. It's gonna go up and spin. I was joking around yesterday saying that Q can take the super highway over there. He's got 11 and a half inches to walk on and I'll take my five and a half. Tell him to come out, boom out. Yep. Down we go. All the way. You're good. Keep going. So that's all she wrote guys. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up, smash the subscribe button down below. And I'll see you guys when we roll these trusses. Hope you enjoyed a little point of view action, setting all these things in place. It's always fun, but the real fun starts when we roll them out. For now, I'm off to another job. Have myself some fun on this Saturday.